Well, hello world. It's Melissa Miller Fadrizi and I am with Remax in Motion. And today I don't know if you can see that sailboat out there. Cued it right up there for you. I am at 23 Maplewood on the west side of Cayuga Lake, you guys. And I am doing something a little bit different in the virtual videos. And I'm just gonna take you through this quickly. Um, here outside, so thank you for visiting. Um, 23 Maplewood, I'm gonna put the link to all the information below, but this is a three bedroom, one and a half bath home. Um, it does have steps down to the lake. It does have a yard, uh, seawall, dock, deck. Um, this, the bedrooms are fantastic in that they have high ceilings. Um, this is a year round home. It is located very close to the Yacht Club. I have upset the dog next door, so forgive me for that. Um, and just wanted to take you for a little quick tour. So a good spin. You guys, I think we shared this the other day. This is Cornell right there. The end and Ithaca, a beautiful sky. There's the dock, there's the property. You guys, we have a set of stairs here that are go up and an elevator that goes up as well. And when I say elevator, it is a motorized way to get up and down. We have a yard. Could be perfect. And we have a beach. So see that area over there? It is coming off of spring into summer. Our cleanup hasn't uh, all occurred but there's a beached area that you can get in and you guys for the most part decently private right when you get to the lake everyone wants to be at the lake and so you're not going to find seclusion unless of course you bring your checkbook so i'm going to take you in through here this deck great sitting spot you guys you're going to watch the sunrise because you're on the west side And then you're gonna come in. Now, here's the joy of being at the lake, is there's some really cool things that you can do when you make these your own. This is a room that looks out over the water, big windows, all of the bedrooms are upstairs. It's got a small galley kitchen. If somebody wanted to rock it, they would figure out how to remove this wall and bring the whole thing in to one space. One thing I will tell you at the lake that you have to be careful of is because it does get so hot, you do want some of these quiet reprieves. Quiet, cool, half bath off the back with laundry. It's gonna be right here. Half bath laundry, closet. You guys, they put new floors in, they put new carpeting in. It's had a paint job. It is ready, summer 2020. Let me show you these bedrooms. I think you will be, again, new flooring. Bedroom number one. Look at that ceiling. Look at the potential. Again, bed, spin, closet, and then storage loft area. Bedroom number two. Corner windows. They're using air conditioned vented out. Again, look at those ceilings, look how high they are. Corner views. Closet, tall ceiling. Bedroom number three. Again, 
again, back of the house. Nice shade reprieve. And then full bath up. Because the house slants, the roof, as you see, slants its way in. Linen closet in the hall. As I take you back down the stairs, I wanted to tell you that in the middle of May here, 2020, the amount of calls that have come in to rent lake places has been astronomical. There's no better place to shelter in place than Cayuga Lake. Could be an incredible investment opportunity an incredible retirement opportunity. The lake is where most families love to gather. It's about connection. And the ability to do some really cool things at the lake that are simple, that are weekend projects can exponentially, and there's the elevator working there, exponentially increase the value of a property. So what you do at the lake versus what you do at the non-lake, you're gonna get more for your return here than you will elsewhere. Thank you for watching, I appreciate it. If we can do anything for you, please let us know. Melissa miller Fadrizi. Remax in motion. Have a great day.